Okay, uh, next on the bench, we have um, uh, Cabal. That's what this is, T-A-D. That's what this is. We have a Cabal here. Um, I guess the issue with this one was missing sprites. Missing background sprites or missing foreground sprites? I believe it was missing... Um, hang on one second. Yes, missing all graphics. <laughs> the only thing that was up was uh, text. So the only thing you got was font. Nothing else. Everything was a complete white screen. Um, when I took it out of the box, I noticed that this cable right here was... This, sorry, this one. Sorry, this one here. Was literally crushed on itself on the inside underneath the in here on the other side it was crushed on itself so obviously the first thing i do is i pull it out because i don't like the way that is let me see if i can get you zoomed in there you can see what i mean it was crushed on itself and it was it was seriously crushed on itself um so let's back you up out of here let's um Let's get just sat down here. And then uh, what we'll do, oh well, there goes that. What we'll do here is, we'll do this in real time. We will, can you see the screen there? Yeah, I think you can. So we'll get the harness on it. Uh, does this require minus five? Yes. second here so we'll get this plugged in I hate these cheap JAMA harnesses mm. I've got a a spare NBA jam tournament edition uh, hang time JAMA harness that I'm really thinking about using because <laughs> I really do hate that Okay, let's hook up the minus five. Let's uh, turn it on. See what happens. I heard. Uh, oh, oh well, hello. Oh, okay. Well, we have graphics. <laughs> well, isn't this going to be a short video? Unless there's something else going on here. The cutoff on the bottom of the screen is the stupid converter board. Well, let's see what happens. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay, so maybe there is something going on here. Alrighty. Okay, so maybe it won't be a short video. Um, that was weird. Um, let's do that one more time. Let me get you set up here so you can see everything. And we're going to do that one more time, except right now... Or while we do it, I am going to do uh, a voltage test. Because um, that was funky. That was real funky. Uh, let's bring that back up. Is that going to come back up? Uh, no. Well, that just took a big poop, didn't it? What's that all about? What if we do away with the minus five? Okay, came back. That means we won't have any sound. Uh, hang on here one second. Let's do that again. What's... Oh, now we have nothing again. What's the voltage I'm getting... What's the voltage I'm getting on the board here? Oh, four point oh yeah okay well that's probably exactly what's going on here uh, so if this board is where the five volts is coming in by the time it makes it all the way over here and all the way through these ribbons and all the way through this at this ROM right here I'm at 4.2 that is not enough that is not 
enough. Okay. So let me sit you back up again. Let's get you set up here one more time. I'm sure you can see everything, right? Focus you in back there. Uh, let's... Um, I hate when these boards don't have a test point like a ground a ground plug you can hold put your probe into that sucks I hate that let's get uh, ground ready let's get 5 volt ready let's get screwdriver ready <clears throat> let's let's do minus 5 let's turn it back on we are getting what Uh, we were getting 4.2. Now we're getting nothing up here. Okay, 4.2. Let's let's turn that up. Now what are we getting up here? We're gonna be nowhere near spec. 4.5. I doubt it. Oh, but look it. Ah, uh, I noticed how it went into reset. It's fine. Yeah. Let's check that one more time. I literally just cranked my power supply. Just literally cranked it. Yeah, 4.532. That's not going to be enough to run it. For sure. It's not. That's way under spec. It should be nothing under 4.9. 4 4.529. Yeah, that's what that was. Mm, I'm wondering if the person who had this had a voltage issue the whole time. Because as you can see, now that I cranked the voltage, it seems to be fine. Uh, and uh, these cheap jamma harnesses here they don't do a very good job at holding the voltage down down the rails they they don't they're they're horrible i mean just think about nba jam just think of the massive harness that is required for it uh or mortal Kombat or mortal Kombat 2 with the extra sound harness and extra sound board and how big the board is to begin with i mean they do fine with actually this this power supply right here is out of that power supply right there is out of a midway cab it's out of an mba jam so i know that it's more than enough i know that that right there is more than enough but yeah it's running yeah it's definitely running do we have Do we have proper audio? Um, let's get a credit going here. Well, I hear it. I don't mean it. Where's is there a volume pot on this? Mm, I might need. I might have to put you on pause. I might have to check the schematic in the the uh, the manual for this yeah that's running and it's not going to work because yeah that yeah you know why I know exactly why I guarantee like it's, it's working I can, you see me shooting you see me shoot a grenade but I bet you the ROM version that's on here is not the joystick version. Unless, unless the dip switches can control that, whether it's joystick or uh, the, dip the dip switches are right, right in here. I wonder, I wonder if I can switch it from uh, trackball to joystick. Uh, I, I may need to, I may need to burn other ROMs though to do that. Mm. I do hear audio, but I don't see a I don't see a volume pot. Oh, unless that's it right there. No, that can't be it. That little pot right there. Oh, there's no way. Can that be it? I'm just checking this stuff here. I just want to see how. Ooh, man, those are warm. Okay, I'm gonna. Well, they're warm because my fingers are cold in the basement. But 
It's an awful lot of RAM here. I don't want to be running this at that low of voltage for too long because even that's even that's just as bad in case you didn't know that is just as bad um mm, 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 mm. all the i mean it, it it could be these bad caps too don't you know don't think it couldn't be because look at the shape of these like is that leaking <laughs> that sure looks like it's leaking to me yeah that sure looks like it's leaking to me let's get something to poke and prod that Oh yeah, yep, that is absolutely leaking. There's no doubt about it that that right there is leakage. I'm surprised it didn't go on the board. Where's my focus on that? Stay there. Yeah, where's my uh, where's my picker? Where's my picker? Come on. Yeah, that to me right there looks. Yeah, that looks like that's leaking. Oh uh, well, just I mean, just to compare, here's the negative band, here, right now. Look at these ones. I mean, they're probably just as bad, but you see how they're not. They don't have that stuff hanging out of them, like that. Mm-hmm. So no doubt those are bad. I think what we're gonna have to do is let me let me zoom you out here. These have probably all gotta go. Good news is oh so that's oh uh, I wonder where this one leads to. I'm gonna do some checks. You know, does this one run the five? Does this one run the twelve? Does this one run the minus five? Blah blah blah. I do see a couple other electrolytics in here. I think the best thing to do is, oh, and I probably cleared up the graphics issue by <laughs> just moving this ribbon. This I bet you if I wiggled this like this, I bet you the graphics would go in and out. So uh, I think the best thing to do right now is I'm gonna split the board. It's just held on by this, 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 and the two ribbons. Let me go ahead and do that and let me do a few checks around here. Like I said, is it, you know, is it 5, 12, minus 5? What are these running? Like, what are these in control of? Where's the volume pot? Let me get all that sorted out. Okay, so the only two that I didn't check are three is four. One, two, three, four is these four here. But these two, this one and this one are across the five. So they got to go. And this one is across the 12. So that's got to go as well. Um, I don't think the minus 5 is an issue. I mean, don't get me wrong. It could be. Oh, oh man. there's Sorry, there's way more than that. I didn't even see that. One, two, three, four, five. There's five right there alone. Uh, oh, six. Yeah, there's six right here alone. This is the sound section here. I didn't find out where the volume pot is yet. But just doing the initial checks, like I said, these two are across the five. This is across the 12. So no doubt that this has everything to do with audio right here. I mean, well, look, you got the Yamaha here, a Yamaha here. Uh, RAM. Uh, those could be operational amplifiers right there. Uh, what else we got? RAM. I'm not quite. Oh, there's another Yamaha. 3931. Another one. 3931 so yeah there's there's the CPU that's running it is there another CPU that's running it or is it just that this is probably some custom chip so like all of this it looks like all of this right here is the entire sound section um, this is probably CPU section this is probably the CPU section right here. This is probably, as far as I can tell, this could all be audio right across here. Mm. I don't even know if I want to mess with these daughter boards yet. Because one here, uh, switching to a 4 meg ROM board. 
And that's how many we have here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then there's another daughter board on this one. And I did notice. Um, right here. Right here. There's been some work done to that before. Oop, 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 oop. Blowing you out there. There has definitely been work there. And that's not me. I mean, that's old as dirt that flux on there but what's killing me here is making me think that work's been done is it's not like that on that connector I checked on the bottom of this connector here it's not like that there it's only this one connector right here on this top board here let me zoom you out only on this one connector right here so work has definitely been done here I wonder if it took a little bit of a I wonder if it took a little bit of a hit because you can tell, like, whoever whoever was in here kind of dug into the board a little bit. Either that or that's really crusty flux. Oh, no, that's really crusty flux. That's what that is. Sorry. But, yeah, they, they definitely did work there. That's for sure. That's not factory. No way. There's no way that they didn't leave it here, left it here, didn't leave it here. Like, there's no way. That's had work done. Maybe it maybe it took a fall back in the day or something. Uh, okay, so I don't have I don't have any axial caps, so I'm gonna have to replace at least these three for now with radial caps, which I I don't care. I mean, it is what it is. What are these, by the way? 470 16 volts. 470 16 volts. 470 16 volts. So. Uh, I do have those, and I'll. If worse comes to worse, I mean, I'll have to order some. But for testing purposes, I don't mind switching, especially these two. These are the these are on the five volt rail. They gotta go, especially this one. This one's leaking. Okie dokie, back to the cabal. Now I just replaced this cap and this cap, and those were both on the five volt rail, and we were getting like 4.6 or something with the power supply completely cranked up so anything less than that was causing a restart um yes this is the volume control and there's another one right there i checked the owner's manual and yeah these both are volume control i don't exactly know why there's two but if i turn this one up yeah absolutely absolutely it does now if you remember this one was leaking not that one. Not one there. That's definitely leaking. Now I just want to see. Actually, let's turn this down. Cause that is that is absolutely cranked. So I was getting four six there. So let's turn it down to about there. And I was probably getting a reset at that. I just want to see if changing out, especially this cap, if I get better, more stable voltage, uh, especially to the top PCB here. Uh, so, uh, meter on DC, jammer harness hooked up, let me get you set up here, let's, uh, let's fire it up, <laughs> and we've got crap on the ground, <laughs> and we've got crap on the screen, you know what, I don't doubt that it's this ribbon. I don't doubt it for a minute that that right there is from that that ribbon right there. Hang on one second. Let's see if I can. I almost guarantee it's this ribbon right here. Yeah, because even that connector seems a little a little loose. Yeah, that is not the best. It's not like this one where it's nice and tight. This one is a little on the wonky side. Okay, let's uh, let's try that again. Actually, while we're doing that, let me get. Uh, well, here we'll fire it up. Oh yeah, we've got like nothing here. What do we have for voltage? Is that right? Four point two. Yeah, that's probably not enough to boot it. That's why. So let's uh, let's turn it up a little bit. Mm, still nothing. Let's turn it 
turn it up again. Oh, that's cranked again. No, we're getting nothing here. What are we getting for voltage here? Wow, it's even worse? Are you kidding me? No, that can't be right. Four, five? No way. Really? Let's remove the minus five. Yeah, we get the same thing here. Yeah, it's definitely this ribbon. It's got to be. It's got to be these ribbons here. They are causing major problems here. I guarantee it. Yeah, I guarantee these ribbons are... Oh, well, that one's not even in all the way. Yeah, see, they keep coming loose. Yeah, that's not even in all the way. Get in there. Get in there. Now, are these still locked? Because they like to move. They're just... See? They're just that loose. Let's get five, minus five back on. Ah, there we go. Now it's running. Can you... Nope. No, you cannot. But it is. Okay, now... Now what are we getting for voltage? First of all, what are we getting at the harness? Yeah, see, 4.6. I'm not going to be able to... Wow, that's all over the place. I thought that would be a lot more stable. Oh, uh, well, I mean, it's... Oh, well, it is more stable. It's at a good 4.5, and that's it. But 4.5 volts is probably not enough. No, but it's not resetting, so it's probably it's probably right on the cusp. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You know what? What didn't I hear? I didn't hear sound. Well, probably because it's turned all the way off. Uh, let's add a credit here. Let's just see if she wants to reset after. see what kind of voltage we're getting now that, now that we're in game. Come on. Yeah, we were getting 4.53, now we're getting 4.50. Okay. Yeah. Man, these powers, this Jamma harness just sucks. Oh, yeah, that is sucking the juice. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Yep. These are just so, so fucking weak. Like, they're getting warm. Yeah, that ground is... Yeah. It's just drawing that much current. I'm sure the power supply can handle it. I'm... I'm... I'm positive it can. It's just, it's the wire. You know, these cheap JAMA harnesses are just, they're so bad. They're so bad. I've, I've got to do something about this. But okay, it's up and running. The voltage does seem more stable. It's not fluctuating back and forth constantly. It is stable when it's running. So, I mean, that was, it had to be changed anyways. Um, What's next? Yes, this is the volume control. You just You just heard me turn it up. Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. I am like two seconds away from getting that spare uh, midway harness and changing this out because this is this is not going to cut it. Amazon Pete, oh, don't buy a JAMA harness from Amazon. Don't do it because it is just not worth it. What does that say that is? What gauge wire? 22 gauge that's yeah that's trash straight trash and that does say that where is it here 22 gauge no no it's got to be beefier than that that's garbage okay well I mean I knew this was going to be an easy one I just didn't expect it to be that easy so I went from not booting to 
booting, resetting. The resetting is probably because, <laughs> believe it or not, probably somebody had the same cheap harness and it was causing the same issue. Because I don't see, I don't see an issue. I mean, besides a, a leaky cap and whatever else, I'm sure this is fine. Hmm. Like I said, like it, it's running, no problem. I don't see an issue. Let's add a coin here. Oh, got no five volt. Or minus five, sorry. Like that is volume control. I wonder what I wonder what that one there is. I don't even know. I can't even get in there. Yeah, that's uh, that. I mean, it's it's running fine. So I think you know what? I think I'll just clean the board up. Even though it's pretty clean, it is pretty clean. Uh, I think I will, you know, make sure that these are these ribbons are good to go. Although you know what, it might it might even have a lot to do with the voltage now. Yeah, see, those are warm. That ground wire is warm. It should not. It should not be. That twelve volt is cold. That minus five is cold. That ground is warm. That five volt rail is warm. It needs more than this. It needs. You know what it really needs? It needs. It needs to have another one of these. Right here, tied into. What is this here? Is this this is? What gauge is this? Why doesn't it say? That's weird. 20 gauge. There it is. See, this is right here. It does say 20 gauge on it. I don't know if you can read that or not. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Um, can I see what right here? 20 gauge. That's what's that's what's needed here. Yeah, because that is just let me back out here. Yeah. Yeah, let that be a lesson. Don't buy these cheap. Look at the difference here. Yeah. Do not. Do not buy these cheap ass harnesses. Straight trash. But yeah, okay. We seem to be running fine. Yeah, we don't have I don't have any glitches, nothing. Zero. can't move because I don't have trackball installed, but I'm sure you get it. All right, I think that'll do it for this one. Uh, we're going to cut that because I don't like that. This, is... Yeah, that is ridiculous. I mean, they're not hot, but they're warm and they shouldn't be. So yeah, I think, I, I think that's it. Yeah, really, I think that's it because the 12 volt rail is fine. Just that one was leaking, this one's leaking. I mean, it's across the five, got to have steady voltage might as well change them right here so yeah i i think that's gonna i think that's gonna be it for this one i mean cabal working